I was, I was going through my speech, and as I was listening to Poe, and pretty much Poe covered everything I'm planning on saying, so this should be pretty quick. And I'm glad Lisa made it in. Do you, do you know where Vijay Shri is? Oh, these, these oh, the okay. <laughs> this is the important stuff. In fact, I'm going to let you hold on to them. I'll, I'll let them come get you. So I'm supposed to give you a State of the Union for the Thai Dallas chapter, uh, and then as soon as I finish that, uh, close this event up. So, uh, as you know, I'm the interim president this year, uh, and I took over uh, after Pratima presented her resignation, and again, uh, for nothing really bad, but it, she, she was just too overwhelmed and she needed to really go focus on her business. And I said, hey, no problem. Uh, we will be happy to kind of manage and run this operation until we get new leadership in place. So the good news is by the end of this year, we're going to have elections and we'll, we'll have a whole new leadership team put in place. But one of the things that I wanted to pay attention to is, and, and maybe this is just maturity of the organization or just maturity of us as, as, over time, is to understand that why do we exist, right? Why does Thai Dallas exist? Uh, and uh, yes, it's to give back, it's to foster mentorship, uh, but you have to really take a much deeper look at this, why do we really exist? And it's really to help mentor the future generation of entrepreneurs. Uh, and if we can get, and I think we've gotten clarity that that's what we really want to do. It's not about making a ton of money. It's not about what deal do I get into. It's about how do we give back. It's the charter for the charter members that we want you to come back as mentors. We want you to give back. Uh, and we were having this discussion over lunch today, right? Having give, giving back without any kind of attachments, right? You're giving, at, giving back purely for the sake of giving back not to get the inside track on this or that. So to what Pavan said, uh, that's, it's been the process that we've been going through over the last couple of years. And I'm, I'm glad and I'm kind of excited right now because I think uh, we have really honed in on the why we exist portion of it. Uh, the how uh, was demonstrated very clearly. In the last couple of years, we've been uh, working on this how part, the mentoring program, the TYE program. These are the hows, right? We've actually got a mentoring program. It's been one year in the, in the works, right? Next year becomes number two. Again, want to recognize Nick for getting that done. Awesome, okay? Uh, I think if nothing else, today's chance for those 16 people to come and present is gonna be amazing for them going into the future. It helps build confidence, a lot of fantastic things. So again, thank you for doing that. Similarly, Ram and the TYE program, another way just to say, hey, how do we give back? How do we mentor? So uh, as far as Dallas is concerned, we're in the right direction. We've addressed the why. We're starting to take care of the how. Uh, and as long as we do that, I think we'll be, in, we'll be in good shape. And I think ultimately that's what sustains the organization. Uh, similar to Austin's cycle, if you want to call it that, and, and Houston's, uh, I'm excited to have Aruna on board. Dallas is, is, is no different. We've had our ups and we've had our downs. But if we can really hone in on this portion, I think we can actually have a sustainable organization that goes on for a very long time. So that's where we are with that. The key to this, we can't do it on our own. Okay? The key is partnerships. And the key is not partnerships just between this group or that group. It's an open partnership. Uh, Mahesh uh, Shetty is here. No, I think Mahesh left. But... Uh, in Dallas, we have the GDICC. They've got a similar program. There's, no need, there's really no need for us to compete with each other. Let's, let's work together and actually let's all, if, if the purpose is really to foster entrepreneurship, let's go do it collectively. There's no harm in that. Uh, similarly, again, I'm delighted and excited about the, the partnership with Ty Austin, Ty Houston, Microsoft, Marsh and McLennan, Tech Exchange, SAP, SAP, I guess I should say, right? Not SAP. Uh, DFW Accelerator. These are, these are programs that we've got into place in the last couple of years. And again, that's amazing because we're actually thinking a little bit broader. Say, so, hey, we all as a group can actually help this community. So again, very, very uh, excited and, and delighted about that. Achievements, I already addressed uh, TYE, uh, the mentorship program. I don't know if Samir is still here, Samir Sony. He's the new uh, chairperson, so to speak, for TAD, the Thai Angels Network. Uh, we're going to, again, bring those under the, under the umbrella of Thai Dallas and, again, collectively do, do it. 
collectively improve what we're doing with Tide Alice. It may be a little bit late, but how many charter members do we have in the house right now? Ram, I know you're there. Um, Bhavan's there. Nick isn't there, I don't know why, but I need to get him in there because that's what we want. The characteristics that we want in our charter members are the guys that are saying, hey, I'm ready to give back, and that's all that matters. Yes, sir? What does it take? Well, you know, we're about to change the rules on that because uh, my, if, from my perspective, it's not about collecting the $1,000 check. It's more about understanding what are you ready to commit to, what are you ready to give back? Uh, and from my personal point of view, it's like, okay, I want your time. The most precious thing we have, you're a very successful person, uh, and if you're gonna be a mentor or be a charter member, my membership wants access to you. So are you ready to commit to, let's just say two hours a month, three hours a month, 36 hours a year, 40 hours a year? Are you willing to give back? If you are, then you're worthy of becoming a charter member. Uh, if you want to be part of this exclusive club, you know, there's plenty of other clubs. I can give you the whole list and you can go join them. So again, a little bit of a shift, but I think ultimately, if we're going to go on this course of, uh, of serving our membership and fostering entrepreneurship, I think we have to make that shift. So we'll, we'll, we'll address that in the next couple of months. So anyway, so much for Tide Alice. Amazing stuff. Pratima and Lisa uh, got this going a couple of years for us. We have continued to grow. Uh, and again, this is what the success does. So again, I want to reach out and thank everybody for that. Uh, I do need to do a couple of things. I need to do a couple of thank yous. Um, for me personally, I wanted to thank Ram, uh, Samir, Nick, Adil, Adi, where is he hiding? He's hiding back there. He continues to be the inspiration, and I was pointing this out also. You, you've got to learn to be vulnerable, and you also have to learn to uh, just go out there on the line, right? So uh, Adil is a great example. He's incredibly su uh, successful, but he's never, he's never afraid of, you know, this is not right, this is not proper. He'll actually push the limits and he's actually done very well. So it's a, it's a trait that we all need to learn from. So again, I want to thank him because I think without his encouragement, I don't think I'll be here today. Uh, finally, I do want to recognize our outgoing executive director, Lisa Chung. She has been an incredible asset to this organization for the last three years. Uh, and she's moving on. She's got some personal things that she needs to take care of. So again, uh, with whoever's here, I'd like to have a huge round of applause for her and everything that she's done for us. And you get a chance to go thank her personally because she's got the drink tickets. Yeah, so, uh, and then again, I want to welcome Vijay Shri. Uh, she's our incoming executive director. I think you've been at the job for what, about a month now? And we kind of said, okay, this is the first thing you need to kind of take care of. So again, very successful event. And again, thank you very much for that. So from a Thai point of view, thank you for those things. Now going back to this particular event, Hemant, and I'm sure I've missed a couple here, okay? Uh, Hemant, Nick, Anita, she's, she's been the steward. She's been keeping us in check just from a budget point of view. Because we have some crazy people like me and Adil and Nick that says, hey, we want this, we want that. But again, thank you very much. Uh, it's a team effort. It, it's been a fantastic event. I think you'll all agree it was a, it was a good day. Uh, we all had a good, a good session. And I uh, encourage you all to become part of our community and uh, help us grow this thing and help us gr give back to the new and young entrepreneurs. With that, this event is officially over. I think we might be back on time. And it's cocktail hour. And Lisa, we do have tickets for everybody, I believe. Where we had lunch? Okay, so the room next door, uh, I believe we've got tickets for everybody. So again, visit with Lisa and I think we'll be here for another hour or two, so feel free to ask any questions you want. Thank you. Thank you.